From the studios at the School of Communication and Journalism, welcome to Stony Brook Media Group's Halftime Report, brought to you by Tropical Smoothie Cafe. I'm Catherine Procacci. And I'm Amy Garcia. Stony Brook's Phi Alpha Delta fraternity hosted a pieing event outside the union. During the event, you were given the option of either pieing one of the organization's brothers or you could pie one of your friends. All the money raised from the event went to Marines Haven Homeless Outreach. Marines Outreach is dedicated to supporting the homeless on the east end of Long Island. They offer support services as well as a warm, safe, temporary shelter to homeless individuals from November through April. They also provide their guests access to basic needs at their day center year-round. Marines' main mission is providing compassionate care for individuals in need. The war is not yet over. Iranian women are still fighting for their lives every day. Reporter Brittany Dietz has more. Last month, Stony Brook celebrated International Women's Day by bringing awareness to the Iranian women who have been fighting for their lives and equality for the past six months. The lack of news coverage about this ongoing war is leading people to forget all about the women who are sacrificing their lives for basic human rights. Stony Brook student Tina Bazad shares their thoughts on the issue as an Iranian woman living in America. Every single day you see horrific stories of people being killed, people being blinded, tortured. I know your life is going on normally, but people maybe a thousand miles away from you are suffering just because they don't want to wear a hijab. Sophomore Nadia Katami expresses the support and hope she has for her country. I'm taking the time to like appreciate the women that are standing up for themselves, putting themselves at risk. No news outlets are talking about it anymore. It's still going on every day in Iran. People should be talking about it. I feel like people here take so many things for granted that people in Iran, in my country, are fighting for. The fight is far from over. Reporting for the Stony Brook Halftime Report, this is Brittany Dietz. Back to you in the studio. Our MVP today is Pam Wolfskill, an Administrative Specialist and MS Program Administrator for the Biochemistry and Cell Biology Department. She recently won the UUP Hansen Award for Excellence in Professional Service. Named in honor of Charlie Hansen, this award is given annually and she is the first woman to receive it. The Hansen Award is awarded to a professional at the chapter who has contributed significantly to and advocated for UUP at the chapter and statewide levels. Pam has been an active member in the union powerhouse at Stony Brook for over two decades. Congratulations, Pam. This is well-deserved. That's it for us in the studio. We'll get you back out to Lavelle Stadium for first half stats and analysis after this.